Well, good morning, folks, and happy July. It's the month of summer and the 4th of July. I want to hear from you. Are you going to be striking, celebrating, or driving Uber and Lyft this 4th of July? Uh, what's up, everyone? My name is Dylan. I want to make this video really quickly because I have a problem. Okay? Okay, I have lots of problems, right? You guys already know that, Dylan. The, the wacky, wacky dude with the crazy hair and, you know, everybody hates me. I get it. <laughs> no, not everybody. Um, comment below. Do you, what do you think about me? I'm actually kind of curious. Okay, don't, don't, don't hold back any, don't hold back at all. No, but in today's video, I have a problem with my Uber account. Uh, I was deactivated. Um, a lot of you guys know that. I've already made videos about that. Um, and I need to get a background check. So, and I'll explain the whole situation, the problem, uh, but I want to hear from you if you've ever had any issues with that. Um, but before I do, I want to thank our sponsor, Play Octopus. Play Octopus is paying Uber and Lyft drivers to put a tablet in the back of your headrest. If you need extra money, they just got bought out by T-Mobile. So they're actually um, paying drivers a lot of freaking money right now. So you want to sign up, use my referral link, because when you do, you get your tablet for free. They're going to pay you up to 100 bucks extra per month, and you'll make more tips. Guaranteed. Not guaranteed, but pretty much. <laughs> Um, and to be honest, the passers don't even need to play the games. You do, you still get paid even if they don't play, which is nice. Alrighty, so sign up for Play Octopus, link below. They're pretty much in every single market, blah, blah, blah. Use my link, check it out, blah, blah, blah. Make some money, let's go. Okay, so basically, uh, what's going on? I have, um, my Uber driver account. I haven't done a ride in, in quite a while. You guys know I, I took a break during, actually, did I drive during the, during the pandemic, the shutdown. I did uh, Uber Eats, I think. Yeah, I think I was doing Uber Eats delivery. I did not want to drive past. Actually, no, I did do a couple rides. I remember I did do a couple rides, but the, the driving with the face mask was... Anyways, I'm not gonna dive into it. Um, but I didn't, I chose not to do um, ride share too much. I did like a few rides and then I tried to do uh, Uber Eats. Anyways. I'm trying to get back into rideshare now, right? You guys see I'm posting on the channel and I want to start driving again because I want to start, one, I want to start recording my rides and I'm going to make sure to ask every single passenger before, you know, like, hey, you know, I'm going to film this video. Do you mind being in it sort of thing? Um, more of like a fun thing. Anyways, um, but look at this guy's here. Okay, so I want to. Okay, so I want to really zoom out so you can't see what my where my location is. But basically, if you go into my Uber driver account, it says unable to go online, right? Um, and it says required action is one, go online when resolved. And it says please contact support about your account. So, and then I click on this, and it says, it says it's time to renew your background check. Review the following disclosure. So a lot of people just click continue, continue, continue. But look at this, guys. Uber Technologies may con obtain consumer reports, investigative reports about your consumer reporting agency in connection with your liability to become an independent transportation provider using the Uber mobile app. That's what your job title is, by the way, if you didn't know that. You're an independent transportation provider. You're not a rideshare driver. You're an independent transportation provider. Rideshare is basically carpooling, right? If you're sharing a ride from one location to a destination. We're essentially taxi drivers. The only time you're technically ride sharing is if you're doing Uber pool or Lyft shared. You're taking you know, people on a similar route together. That's ride sharing. If you wanna be a ride share driver, just stick to Uber pool and Lyft shared. Otherwise, you're, you know, you're a taxi driver. You're a transportation provider. These reports may include information about your character, general reputation, personal characteristics, and or mode of living. The reports may also include information about your criminal history, motor vehicle driving records, uh, which may contain information about your physical, mental, or behavioral health maintained by a state government agency that, is, that has restricted your ability to drive legally, or other background checks. They obtain background checks from the following checker. Uh, yeah, basically checker and higher right. So... Anyways, I, I, a lot of people don't read this, but if you go up here, it says they're going to obtain information about your motorcycle vehicle driving records. Well, if you guys have been following my channel, I got a freaking dang traffic ticket. Why? For, um, it was for, uh, 
well, I don't want to incriminate myself just in case Uber's watching this. We're going to deactivate me permanently. But basically, it was a... I got a, I got a ticket for... I don't... I'm not going to say what it is. You know, just, just in case Uber's watching. <laughs> but I got, a, I got a ticket while I was driving. I pulled over. Right? I was doing something... It could have been a illegal lane change for all you guys care, right? I got a ticket and when I renew this, I'm afraid it's not going to show up. I'm afraid it's going to show up and I'm not going to be approved. So I wanted to make this video and ask you guys, in your experience, have you had this case where, you know, you, you were approved before and then you got, because I've heard of drivers getting, you know, things like that. But have you gotten a traffic ticket? I'm not talking about, you know, anything crazy, you no know, criminal stuff. I'm talking about like, like running a, a stoplight, for instance, or doing, or turning right on a no, no turn on right, or, you know, illegal lane change or speeding or whatever it is. Something like that, an actual traffic ticket, not following traffic laws, because that's what mine was about. Again, I don't want to get into the specifics, just, you know, for the sake of the, my own protection, but um, I'm afraid that it's going to show up and they're not going to approve me. So let me know your thoughts, please, because it would be very helpful if we could, if I could hear you from you guys before I click actually continue. And yeah, guys, anyways, yeah, that's it. That's the update. I do really, really, really want to start driving again. And again, start doing the ride videos because I think that would be super fun. And I know Ryan is driving, just started posting again. Shout out to him. But yeah, guys, uh, check out Play Octopus, link below. Um, they're paying Uber and Lyft, and I will be using Play Octopus, by the way, 100%, 100%, 100%. So, and I already have been, I love Play Octopus. They pay drivers up to 100 bucks extra per month. It's free to sign up when you use my link. You'll get fast-tracked. They're probably in your market now. They're, they just got bought out by T-Mobile, so they're making a ton of money. And uh, you can too, share those profits. All right, guys, thanks for watching. I'll talk to you soon. Bye now.